Hello everybody, I'm a simple gamer. Welcome back to some more Advanced Wars 1 Reboot Camp Challenge Campaign. And it's time to do Battle Mystery Mission 21. The Hidden Lander. Last one before Rivals. Just gotta get this out of the way. Shouldn't be too hard since it is just find the lander. If I have to, I'll just like restart and then go straight forward or something. Even then, I'm pretty sure I have a good idea where it is. Andy. Definitely in the reef somewhere. No. <laughs> Vital cargo, just gotta destroy uh -huh. it. Yes. I'm pretty sure it's right here. Unless that they moved it like uh, back near the HQ or something, but I'm pretty sure it's right here. I just gotta get to it. With two subs of battleship and then a lot of, a lot of ground units, I should be fine. Fastest way is probably going on this area, then just going straight down. But I don't quite know where Drake's other units are, so I should take it easy at the very least a little bit. For now, I am definitely gonna send one sub in to scout things out. Got a battleship there, got a recon. Recon has the five vision. So I guess I'll just put my battleship right at the edge of that battleship and probably sink it next turn or something. Uh, up here. I do have two landers. I guess I should uh, go both top and bottom, honestly. Well, of course, if there is a unit in here, then my units are going to get destroyed. Uh, if I, like, send them down there. Same with, uh, well, not really to the right. So I guess the right's probably safer. I guess I'll send a recon and a rocket over that way. Recon first. Spot nothing. Drop rocket down. But I guess for all I know, yeah, the lander could be not be here either. As I already said, so I should be a little bit more careful. Uh, bottom side, I guess I want tank and then MD. MD to the right. Actually, MD to the bottom might not be that bad. Nah, I'll put it to the right. Okay, no unit there. My other sub, I guess I'm gonna stay here. Yeah, and I'm not gonna die for him to save on some fuel. Other than that, all the, my other units are gonna go on city since they can't do anything right now. My cruiser's gonna stay here. I I guess. Guess my other lander, sorry, my other cruiser's gonna go down a little bit in case a sub appears out of nowhere. My battleship, as I already said. Here is probably not that bad since it covers backwards and forwards as well. One, two, three, four, five, and the recon can't spot my battleship either on this spot. Maybe I'll be okay here. But kind of do want it in range of the uh, Drake's battleship, so I guess right there. Okay, just gotta see what happens now. Well, of course, it's first the Drake dog. Got hooked. Maybe I'm underestimating this map or something. Battleship moved up. There is a sub to the left. The recon came up. Kind of annoying. But nothing I can't deal with. I mean, he can't spot my recon. But I think I'm completely okay. I mean, it is going to be a pain trying to get to the bottom there. So I guess I should actually send my uh, sub bottom left. Since I do have my recon to the right to schedule up here. See if any forces uh, pop up this side. Also got to make sure if there's any units there. Well, first I guess I'll attack my rocket. Since my rocket can't attack anything else. Do that. I would attack the recon, but as I said, rocket can't reach it. My sub might not be able to sink it. 48. My other sub can't reach. 
63. I think this should be fine. If Drake does have a cruiser up here, probably will attack my sub already. So for now, I guess I'll try to sink the- well, destroy the recon, I mean. Since that is what's giving Drake vision right now. Do something like that. Recon attacks right here. Oh, that's not a kill. Ooh. Maybe if I get lucky. There we go. Good. Stop attacks, as I already said. Maybe I'll get lucky again, but... Oh, nice. Okay, with that done, there shouldn't be any other units oh, down here, so... Oh my... well, I guess... Since, since my sub can now move left, I don't need this sub to go uh, bottom now. He can just stay there and scale, but as I said, I already have my recon. If anything, my recon might go right here to attack or something. Of course, I'm not actually sure if the... Lander is right here. That is why I'm trying to send units to the left to, to scout out, so my recon does have to go south soon. Soon, but not yet. Okay, I do know that there's a sub there, so I guess I'll put my lander. Ah shoot, it's right there actually. Oh well, that's fine. My infantry can do it. Yeah, like that. And then now I guess I'll just use both my cruisers to sink it. 72. And then if a sub does appear on the top, I can just move my uh, cruisers back. No biggie. Attack like that. I guess I should just move my sub down. Since I do need vision there. Actually, this sub can also come down here and get vision from me too. Should be able to scout quite a, quite a large view actually, so... If my recon does move, then I guess my sub should stay there. Drake, uh, does have power. That's fine. I'll do turns now. Can track it down. Guess I should also send my other landing back. Just wondering what should I do. Rather than put them in a lander, I guess that's probably fine to just leave them on the cities. I don't want to move my tank up just yet, so I guess I'll put my MD tank right there and then move my tank on the city. Ah, hello there artillery. Okay, nope, cannot spot my tank unless there's like another unit down here. I guess I should have thought about there's like a battleship down here too. But we'll see what happens after Jig uses his power. I guess I shouldn't have moved my tank up since I don't have cover and fire for it. Anchors away! Since my battleship attacks up to the tank. This is fine. When I do get Andy's power, I'll heal all that back up. Man, does that take long though. I mean, it does hit all the units, but you know. It still takes way too long. Not quite sure. Oh, there's a... There's a sub. There's a cruiser. I guess I should sink the cruiser since it did move up. Why not? No power for me. Since the one damage doesn't actually give me power. Tank to infantry. Sure. Either way, I don't think my MD tank can one-shot the artillery, so I can't do anything about that. Ooh, I just lost vision though. And I think I need my sub up here. Actually, no, I can just use my two cruisers to protect my battleship, actually. This is my uh, sub uh, down the bottom is the scouting. So I guess this guy's gonna come here, die. Now I can attack the cruiser. I'm also do it when Drake can't build power. Not like I have to sink it since I'm not going around that way. Unless if I lose all my units somehow. Rocket attacks are right there. And then I guess my recon can't probably finish the job. 
but do I risk it? Since if, it, if there is a sub here, like in the regular classic mode, then they're gonna have vision on my recon. Which I don't wanna give. No point in doing that. Okay, tank attacks. If anything, if the artillery does stay here, then my tank can finish it off, and then my MD tank can go attack the tank. Guess I'll drop. Uh, I only have one space, so I guess I'll drop my tank to the right. It can help maybe like push through if I need to. Well, I can like capture at the bottom. Oh, this lander can't make it though. I mean, I don't really mind setting like an infantry to the right. I guess that's fine. I'll just drop the next turn or something. Actually, no, 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 sub, sub, sub. Almost forgot about the sub. Whoops. Subs have five. Yep, five. One, two, three, four, five. So, since I already uh, put them in, I might as well drop my units here. And then now, probably. Actually, no, he only has have five vision. So, he won't be able to see this space unless if he has like a second sub or something. I just don't want him having vision on my infantry and then the artillery attacks me, but probably won't do that much damage though. And then I do have a backup there as well, so I guess that's fine. Uh, I guess I'll end my turn now then. Infantry is capturing. Wait a sec, what's attacking? Oh, the artillery. Oh, whoops. I should have moved my recon away, whatever. Oh, another... Huh, battleship. Close enough to attack my recon, you say. That's kind of annoying. I don't have a high enough vision unit to spot the artillery back there. Okay. I guess I'll brute force it a little bit here. Hopefully there's no like rock in the woods or something. Since I did the push through eventually. Attack like that. That sucks to lose my high vision recon though. Okay, I'll move my tank up, start capturing here. I guess I could probably put my sub right here now. Yeah, and then I should be able to spot the artillery and finish it off. By the way, Cruz is gonna take a look at the sub now. Help build Annie's power meter some more, even though it also gives Drake's, but that's fine. I'll go look at that. Ah, there's a cruiser, but I think I'd rather take care of the artillery. Like so. Good thing I kept my uh, sub dive. Because if the battleship is close enough, it'll probably destroy my sub. But there's the battleship. Probably can't reach my uh, cruiser though. So I'll attack like that. And then I think I'm gonna move my battleship in. Support the bomb side. Destroy everything. Just gotta stay out of the vision range. But it should be fine if I like stay right here. Three, four, five, six. Tank has three vision over there. Nothing in the woods, of course. And now I guess I put yeah the other two in here. This guy's gonna go up here. Tank is also gonna move up, and then I just drop after like uh like that. And then yeah, should be okay. Probably go for gonna put the infantry in my APC, but that's another turnover. And now my APC can like uh, give fuel and ammo and turn. I should deal about two damage, I believe. Yep, down to seven. I would rather have my MB tank being full HP, but whatever. I don't have a way to deal with the cruiser though. Unless if it comes closer. 
Ah, of course. But that's fine. The cruiser out there doesn't matter too much. All I gotta do is just break through like uh, these guys and then go for the lander probably right there. Probably gonna be kind of a hard fight since Drake probably does have quite a number of units back here to defend the lander. Either way... That's a 39. Got using my power now. I mean, Drake is gonna get his power next turn because of what I'm gonna do. But I might be able to sink the battleship. But, once again, that doesn't matter too much. Okay, let me do that. 4 damage. And then I guess my cruisers just run away. Battleship attacks a tank. Yeah, I can punch through without using power. If possible, I would like the... The cruiser here to chase me down so that I can attack him with my battleship. But, once again, why do I care so much? All I gotta do is put my battleship in range of uh, this place. Guess I'll scale a little bit more of my sub. Ah, hello there, enemy tank. Let me attack there. I, actually, my battleship might be in range to attack the enemy tank. And it is. Too bad my MD tank is not. Yeah, it just barely doesn't reach. So let me attack like that. No, oh, I guess I can bait the MD tank over. Since there should be an infantry here, yeah. Bait. Right there. But I guess I put my tank here. Like, if the MD tank tries to go for my tank, it'll be stopped by my tank. Infantry can go here, so I guess I go right here. Then I can move my tank back, attack the infantry. MD tank attacks here. Oh yeah, the tank does get vision as well, so hopefully there's no indirect in the woods. Uh, as I said, I'll do that. Refuel. And then these guys. I guess I can sacrifice the lander right now. Keep the battleship from moving. And then I guess my cruisers can also surround the... Well, no, no, I can't surround the battleship. Drake has power? He does. I guess I want my sub right here. No, I, I do want the battleship to move if possible. Uh... Put the lander as a bait. No, but I, I won't be able to kill it though next turn. So I guess I do have to move back. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cruiser just goes back here. And then I guess I end my turn now. I mean, my rocket is running out of ammo, but that should be fine. Yeah, I completely forgot about the tank of vision. Panic is for that means I am going to lose my tank. Feels kind of bad. But I should be able to destroy the empty tank and then keep pushing after. Just gotta see if any other units pop up. 8 HP, 6 for my empty tank. Battleship comes up. Tank, oh, tank actually moves away. So, AI being AI does some very weird things. Okay, I'm gonna use my power. Do that. I'm all ripped up. Yeah, I guess I should finish off the MD tank. Hyper Even repair. though I did have to waste a turn repositioning my uh, battleship. Just to get it out of the way. Yeah, 37 is definitely not a good look. Tag right there. After this though, I probably don't need any more help from my battleships and I can focus on the... 
on whatever is, uh, if the lander's in there. Oh, shoot. My MV10 can't reach. That's awkward. Oh, yeah, I didn't move. Okay, got it. In that case, I guess I, I'll just ignore it then. One tank will have to finish off this tank. Yeah, like that. And then if the MD tank moves to attack my tank, that's fine. Like, if there's a sub over here, like I think there is, it actually sees my tank. I'm gonna put that tank right there. APC goes right there. And then the infantry is gonna meet the infantry down here. And then fight right there. Okay. I can finish off him. Just gotta move my crew out of the way, maybe. Yeah, probably. Put my cruiser right there. Finish him off. And then I guess I can also start moving my rocket down. Since I don't actually care about the cruiser anymore. And that turn... And these tanks gonna attack my tank. No? Okay, it does. Since it is off the city now, I can just attack it, even if I do lose my tank. Especially since it is a little bit uh, damaged now from heat. Something's moving closer though. Wait, how did that infantry spawn my APC? Ah, oh, whatever. Nope, I'm not quite sure what spawns it. I guess it, it doesn't really matter too much. Guess I'll move my tank here. Ah, Lander is not there. So that means I do gotta find it somewhere. This is not there, that just means that I can destroy the empty tank. Like that. That means I do have to go searching for it. It's not there. Yeah, it might be like back here then. Maybe the center tile right there? Maybe. That does mean that I do have to... Refuel everyone with my APC. That is kind of why I didn't just like send up on its way to die. Okay, rocket. One ammo up. Yeah, rather than attacking the cruiser, I'd rather start moving down. But then... I just don't know if there's anything here. Okay, there's the sub. One, two, three, four. I mean, if there's something, there's something that's gonna attack me anyways. Doesn't really matter too much. The rocket can attack over there. Sub has one, two, three, four, five. Can shouldn't be able to spot my APC. But just in case, I guess I should drop my infantry down. Guess my sub could start. Well, no. I I need fuel before this guy starts moving. Actually, no. It should be fine. Ah. Okay. I guess I blocked this cruiser in. And then I'll refill my sub when it's like, up top. Oh, this could be a pain trying to find the lander now. My tank is gonna take damage, unfortunately. Oh no! Rocket at top. No, I'm pretty sure it's in range. One, two, three. Oh no, no, no. Never mind. Just barely outside of range. Like the vision range of this uh, sub. 18 fuel left. I guess I capture for fun. That means I gotta start moving my battleship probably up to try to help out. Actually, no, I probably should sink the sub. So, no more vision. And then I'll move my battleship after. It does give Brick more power bar, but what can I do? Attack like that. Start moving my APC up. 
I guess I'll take back the infantry. Ah, uh, whoops, never mind. Well, if anything, I, think I can just refuel the APC if I need to, uh, like a city after I capture. Uh, tank will come over here. And then help me, like, spot the other reefs. Attack like that, say goodbye to the rocket. <laughs> Where is this lander? Thank goodness there's no, uh, actual turn in the dome. I might get a bad score, but at the very least I'll win. Attack right there. Yeah, I guess I probably shouldn't have thought that the lander would be there in, like in a classic campaign. Uh, this guy's gonna go around. And then my cruiser is just gonna accompany it. Why not? 13 feel more than enough. Since my APC goes up, I feel it, and then stuff probably goes here, checks this place. Oh well, I'll, I'll do that next turn. And that turn. Oh, infantry is probably gonna attack my infantry. Guess that's okay. Ah, that's fine. Infantry is on the city. 4 damage, 4 damage. Nothing else? Okay. I kinda do want the city though. Uh, guess my tank gonna scout there. Nothing. Does Drake even have any more ground units though? I wonder. Guess my sub will check. Okay, ABC does not reach. Great. I guess my cruising will check. Not there. I guess my sub goes right here. Right, right there. Rocket will also go up and get refueled. And then my other cruiser is gonna keep blocking the way. Now, is there anything in the woods? No. Well, this is gonna take a while then. Oh, I, I guess I can also start moving this up too. Oh, that's a little bit awkward. Time to surround that uh, cruiser with my landers. So I took care of this up here. I guess the lander could be there then. But yeah, just gotta go around like that, block the way. I don't know, this sub might be useful, so that's why I'm saving it. And that turn... Does Drake have another battleship? I don't know... I'm pretty sure that's just an infantry movement. I feel like that as well. Well, again, I guess. Okay, so... Cruiser... At the very least, I can spot if there's anything here. If the lander is here, then... Uh, once again, at the very least, my units will be in position. I guess I don't really want to destroy any more units. No, <laughs> definitely no need to give uh, Drake power. I guess I'll put my rocket like that. Just in case it is here. If it's here, my uh, my rocket can go like... Here, one, two, three, four... Actually, here. This covers both spots. Yeah, it covers both spots and then... The sub can take care of this place while my battleship can take care of this one. Unless if the lander is uh, actually like down here somewhere. Like uh, that spot. That, that would be quite annoying. Or like down here somewhere. Too bad I don't have my recon to check. That means my sub might have to go all the way around down here to spot it for me. Okay, I guess I'm gonna leave it at that. Got no choice now, but to end that turn. The cruiser are definitely just chilling. Since I did block the way. Okay, let's see if the sub, sorry, land is right here. No, that means it's probably right there. I guess I just gotta keep ending my turn then. 
Oh, I might as well put my rock right there. No, no reason to move around. But I guess my tank can go check this place out a little bit. Nope, nothing. Too bad my cruiser can't reach that reef this turn. What are they, well, I guess Drake's not really moving a unit, but just uh, ending the land this turn. Okay. One tile away, great. I guess I'm, I'm, uh, well, I guess my sub gun will get there. And that turn... Yeah, this map's pretty easy, it's just hard part is, uh, getting to Lander. Well, no, it's figuring out where Lander is. And now, Cruiser... There it is. Day 13, great. What do I want to finish this off with? Did my rocket was actually doing quite a bit of work. And then I guess my bouncer can finish off on the cruiser for fun. I guess I'll start with the rocket, check damage myself, see if I need my uh, bowship. I don't think I'll need it. 77, yeah. I'll just finish off the other cruiser for fun. 76. No, I don't. Think Andy Sub will be able to do it. Max maybe, but probably not Andy. Attack right there. Now I guess Drake only has two more units left. Lander. Oh, actually at the 20. Maybe it would have been enough, but that's the only one unit that I could destroy. Okay, so finish this for me. Kind of a bit slow in the middle because I guessed wrong where the sub was. Probably should have known they would move from classic campaign. I'm Poseidon's trident. Let his guard down, but I'm done. Uh. This again. I guess this, this is technically like my sixth time seeing this. <laughs> and let me see that bad speed score. Things are finally getting interesting. 72, okay, that's a B. That's fine. Sorry, A, 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 yeah. As long as you don't know where the lander is, you just go all the way around, pushing to the top, and then ignoring everything at the bottom. Yeah, that's about it. Oh, uh, you could technically still, like, position your bow ship in the middle. And then attack from all sides. Eh, yeah, that works too. Anyways, that's done. I I already got like the S from like the Huzzah! challenge campaign as a whole. Oh, there it is, Eagle. I am not ready. Look look at all those stars up there. Let me count one, two, three, four, five, six, ten. Okay, and Sturm is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Okay. I think it's gonna be easier, but that's gonna be it for this one. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time for Rivals. By easier, I mean like compared to uh, the original Vance Wars one, but I'll talk about that more in like a couple of days when I actually play it. Okay, see ya then.